guys, it's Lindsay. I'm sorry I haven't been making any videos within the past week. I've been busy with school and work, but I'm finally back and I have a few products to show you guys that I absolutely love. And so my first one is going to be an eyeshadow palette by BH Cosmetic. And it's the 28 color uh, eyeshadow palette with neutral uh, eyeshadows. And the packaging is like a matte plastic um, casing. And on the back it shows the ingredients and the BH Cosmetic logo with the... Um, website on them which I will be putting in the description box the website and inside are these beautiful beautiful neutral uh, eye colors uh, eyeshadows now the camera does wash these out and so you have to take in mind that uh, some of these are going to look very white and very much the same but they are not trust me now over here are going to be your highlight colors and some of these are going to be your lid colors and over here is going to be your dark your darker crease colors. Um, this one is a beautiful black color. This is a darker brown. It's kind of like a taupey brown color. And this is a really dark, beautiful, shimmery, um, dark purple color. Now, some of these in BH Cosmetic uh, palettes do have matte finishes, satin finishes, and as well as shimmery finishes. Now, the black is a matte finish and this is a shimmery finish. Now I will show you all of these up close. You can you can see the shimmer and you can see the matte and some of the shimmer as well. Um, there you go. The camera kind of picks it up better like this but these do have some shimmer in them and it has a variety of colors. It's not all browns. It does have a variety of purples right here pink, uh, and then a little bit of uh, green undertone in some of these colors, and uh, it also gives you a variety of the browns. It gives you lighter browns, orangier browns, like bronze colors, and then really, really dark, deep, um, very warm colors. And on my next uh, product that I have received within the past week is MAC Myth, and here's the packaging. It's just a regular MAC um, casing with the metal inside and here is the product that's the color can you see that here there you go that's the accurate color and i will be trying this on uh i will give you the positives and the negatives about this lipstick i've been dying for it uh, i am really into nude lips uh not concealer lips but i do like a nude lip now the thing about mac myth is you do have to wear a moisturizer or something underneath it because it will catch on to every crack and it's very drying. And I know there's a lot of reviews out on YouTube that talks about how drying MAC Myth is. And trust them, it is. It's extremely drying. I love the color payoff. It doesn't give me a concealer lip. Now, I'm going to start off by using my Nivea Touch of Kiss. Uh, Kiss of Moisture, sorry. Just moisturize it. Make sure, okay, the tip about these kind of lipsticks and MAC is this is also a satin finish. So it is going to be a little bit drying. So make sure you exfoliate your lips. Okay, and to exfoliate your lips is what I did. I take a wet rag and I just rub it across my lips and get all the dead skin off. And you can just pick it. Uh, it there's no technical way to exfoliate your lips. But, as well, I moisturize with chapstick or conditioning lip balm, which I have right here. And it's kind of a nudie lip balm, but it doesn't, it's very sheer, you can't see it. Um, see? Can't see. I will be giving you a swatch of myth on my hand, but for right now I'm going to show you what it looks like on the lips. Okay. I have the moisturizer on. Here's the lipstick. Ta-da! I don't think it gives me a concealer looking lip because that would be more on the white side, but this does have a pinky undertone if you really like uh, nude lips that have pinky undertones. I like the finish of it, but as well as on the MAC lipstick, especially this one, it does create cracks whenever you move your lips like that. It does show, you can't see it on the camera, but it does show uh, where 
there is lines and this is a trick that I do just dab it with your finger Now I would say MAC Myth is a more matte type of lipstick and it goes on very well. It covers so swiping it straight on and swiping it all over the place is going to give you a very concealed look so watch out for that. Uh, make sure you dab it and then you rub with your finger and pat it and it gives you a very pretty nude color if you're very into nudes. Now my swatch. a pretty good swatch and I'm light skinned and overall I absolutely love this lipstick but you do have to pair a conditioner with it or some kind of moisturizing lip balm but other than that I love my nude lipstick and I love MAC Myth and I will be ordering more because I need it but it does last a very long time during the day it lasts me about three to four hours which is very surprising for a lipstick for me because I talk a lot and I always I'm drinking something or I always have something messing with my lips to where it, my lipsticks never stay on and so this is a very very nice nude. The price of this is about $15 on MacCosmetics.com. It's very pricey and I did it for shipping because I live in a very small town and there's no Mac anywhere near me. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this small little review. So rate, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you want to see in the future. Tell me if you like this or not. Um, talk to you guys later. Bye.